Hey YouTube, it's me Jessica. Um, just thought I'd do a quick update video. Um, not much is going on with me currently. Um, waiting for my surgery date, uh, which will be January 15th. So on Friday of this week, which will be Christmas, it will be exactly three weeks to my surgery date. So um, just kind of waiting for time to go by. Um, I'm going to officially start my liquid diet um, January 1st which is five days before I have to start it but um, I'm just gonna run with the new year and do five extra days of a liquid diet so a um, little less or a little more than a week to go till I get to that so um, today is Wednesday December 23rd um, so along with everybody else I had to do a video with my uh, Christmas tree in the background um, also in front of the window I don't know if you guys can see but uh, it is snowing here in Minnesota so we are going to be having a white Christmas from the sounds of it we already had snow on the ground but um, I guess it's kind of always nice when you got a fresh snowfall or when it's snowing on Christmas I guess if there's any day out of the year for it to snow that's one of those days where it's actually kind of nice to have snow so um, again, 23rd of December today. Today is my youngest baby's birthday. Um, she's 13. <laughs> so she's not so much of a baby anymore. So, uh, I officially have three teenagers. Lord help me. Um, but this Christmas is going to be a little bit different for me. Um, actually all of my kids are not here. So it's just just me this Christmas so it's kind of sad um, I don't live around my immediate family um, most of them live in Arizona uh, also Colorado but I do have some extended family that are here in Minnesota actually my parents were born and raised here so um, I might go see my grandma but I really don't have any plans for Christmas um, my, I've convinced my kids that we're actually going to have Christmas on January 24th. Um, so once they get back, we'll be waiting a couple weeks and we'll be having Christmas a month late. So, um, of course they're older so it doesn't really matter to them. It's not like they think Santa Claus is coming. So, um, anyways, what did I want to talk to you guys about today? Um, I picked up a couple things. Um, trying to get ready for how my life is going to change um, for 2010 and um, I guess this is going to be the year of me believing in me so that's what 2010 means to me um, the surgery is going to help me um, but I know there's lots of things that I have to change so um, I got two things the last time I went to uh, Barnes & Noble to kind of help me out and I'm going to kind of show you and explain to you why I got them. So uh, the first thing I got here is this Hope Journal. Um, this is what I'm going to log um, my weight in, uh, my exercise, my food, um, anything like that as far as having a good day or a bad day um, and kind of if I have any problems with food getting down or just anything relating to how I feel what I eat and what my activity level is going to go in here and the reason I got this is because for me the surgery gives me hope so um, it's symbolic but also in each day and I'm sure you can't see this on the camera but it actually has a um, kind of a quote up here uh, and this one says always be in a state of expectancy and see that you have See that you leave room for God to come in as he likes. And then at the bottom it says, I wait for the Lord. My soul waits. And in his word I put my hope. So um, for me it's just kind of a uh, one place to put all my thoughts and my progress. So I can look back on this and kind of track um, the good things, the bad things, whatever works and what doesn't. So um, that's going to be this. Secondly, I am one of those people that prefers to get on the scale every day, so I will be a daily weigher. Um, I do know that my weight fluctuates by day, but it's just something me personally, it keeps me focused on what the task at hand is, and I don't get discouraged when I see the scale go, you know, up, or I don't get 
super excited when I see it go down. I just know that it's a process and I'm going to see ups and downs. But um, I got this calendar and it says you can heal your life, which I thought was kind of fitting because um, this will be a healing process for me. I hope to kind of um, get back to who I know I am on the inside. But um, on the inside it's got pretty um, pictures and the top of this one says the point of power is always in the present moment and then down here it's got a I think a portion out of the ladies book who actually did this calendar so this is where I'm going to be um, logging in my weight daily when I actually get on the scale in the morning then I'll transfer it over to my um, journal where I, where I log everything else but um, those are just a couple things that I'm getting to kind of prepare myself for the endeavor that I have coming up so Anyways, um, if this movie isn't too long, I'm going to kind of turn you around and give you a shot of the wonderful white snow that is falling, and you can see what that looks like here in Minnesota. So, um, hope you guys have a Merry Christmas, and I'm sure I will be um, doing a video before the um, New Year. So, thanks for all my new subscribers. Thanks for the support from you guys that have been helping me out, answering a lot of my questions. I certainly appreciate it. So, uh, thanks, guys. Have a Merry Christmas. Hey, guys. As promised, I said I would show you um, the snow falling here in Minnesota. So I'm going to turn you around and kind of show you the view from my balcony so you can kind of see what it looks like here in Minnesota two days before Christmas. So here we go. I know it's kind of hard to see the snow falling. You can see it a little bit, at least from what I can tell on the screen, but um, you can see obviously there's fresh snow falling on the cars. There was already snow on the ground, so like I said, here's kind of the view. You can see over there a couple snow piles from the last uh, snowstorm we had a, a week or so ago. So anyways, this is what it currently looks like here in Minnesota and I wish you could see it snowing better but I guess you can see it falling there in the sky but it certainly is nice to kind of see the snow falling at this time of year so anyways guys again happy holidays Merry Christmas and I hope everybody has a wonderful time with your friends and family this holiday season thanks bye